I'll keep an eye on things out here. I'll stay here as well, to keep an eye out for any potential threats. If the Iconoclasts reach that ship first, there won't be any chance for a peaceful monarch. I don't suppose you've found the targeting module yet. I've sent but They're all mad! And what's more, they left us! I don't see any way for us to work together. Ugh, not this again. Remember what we practiced, sir. Yes. The words in those reviews were very hurtful, but they do not define me. I am a mantipiller, and my will is my cocoon. I can emerge and become whatever I wish. I hadn't thought of it that way. Perhaps you have a point. Supposing you're right, who exactly would you have me work with? The Iconoclasts are not the most compromising sorts. That's an interesting suggestion. I confess I don't know much about her except that she worked for Rizzo. I'd be willing to consider it, but I need to see her review first. One can't be haphazard about these things. Besides, if you think her skills will complement mine, then we should see what those skills are. Excellent. Her review would be in the Rizzo offices in Cascadia. Bring it to me, and I'll see if she's qualified. That's surprising. The board's equipment is usually in top shape. After all, they have first access to any fresh parts or components. Agreed. This is mysterious, to say the least. A conspiracy? You've spent too much time around Graham.
just that good.
Is that a ship out there? Looks fairly well banged up.
Captain, we should chat. Graham's got the right idea, but he isn't the right guy to execute it. I don't even think he's motivated by philosophism anymore. I think he's just guilt-ridden. Let's be frank here. He's an unhinged charlatan. You're not wrong, but get the hell off your high horse, preacher. This ain't exactly easy for me. I can't believe I'm even saying this, but... I keep going over and over it in my head, and the only way I see the Iconoclast surviving is... we depose him. Okay. Deep breaths. This is what's best, Sora. Time to save Monarch. Captain, you must be back with the access codes to our new ship. Graham, we need to talk. We have work to do. This isn't the time for one of our spats. Stand down. I'm afraid I don't understand, Captain. You're running the Iconoclast into the ground, and I don't believe it'll get better after we take Stellar Bay. The troops take orders from me already, and you've... You've brought me as far as you can down the Eternal Path. It's time to step down. The troops. Listen to you. This isn't an army. They aren't soldiers. They're believers. Followers. 
They pick up a gun because you tell them to, not because they want to. And you, Captain, after all you've done for me, for us, you throw behind this mutinous blasphemer? How can you say that, after all I've done for the Iconoclasts? They wouldn't be here without me. I built this movement from the ground up. I've brought freedom to Monarch, and all these years later, we're still free. I joined because I believed that you were in it for the Iconoclasts. That you wanted nothing more than to bring freedom to Halcyon. That you were selfless. But I know the truth now, Grim. I know what happened in Amber Heights. You didn't start this movement because you wanted to save us. You wanted to save yourself. No. I escaped the corruption of the endless cycle of corporate greed. Yes, I ran from that. But now I'm ready to face it once more. I've spent years atoning for my sins. I've studied, meditated, taught. I built the Iconoclasts so that any man could cast away his past for a fresh start. That's your answer, Graham? You needed a fresh start? After all those innocent lives? I'm sorry. I believed in you once. I did. But it's over. Stand down. I won't. What happened back then was a mistake, and the colony has moved on. This is my movement. Please, don't make me do this, Graham. If this is where my path ends, I accept it. But as long as I draw breath, I will not abandon them. So be it. Incoming! Well, Captain, here we are. Killed a lot of people in the name of the Iconoclasts, and it never feels right. But this time, it's especially wrong. You've got the... Void held me. I'll never remember what that thing is called. The device from the ship. Do you have it? I've thought about it, but... I think we're too far gone. Pulling Carlotta's support was crossing a line. You know, Captain, I never thought about that. Maybe he could be taught the eternal truth. Spread the message from within the corporations. All right. If he's willing to talk, I'll give him a chance. Thank you.